Glad to be bringing you action and welcoming you to Vegas, where they do it bigger and better than any other city when it comes to the big time fights. We're at the Thomas and Mack Center. Our main event should be a good one tonight. 10 rounds in the heavyweight division between Smoke and Joe Frazier and Iron Mike Tyson. Joe Frazier's got a target on his opponent from the moment he steps out of that locker room to every step he takes during this ring walk, you can see exactly what's in his scope. Mike Tyson's got his eye on the prize. He has complete focus on his ring walk here. have a good clean fight touch them up well they've been waiting for this moment and now they get it round one underway unable to land clean by mike tyson tyson's showing you that sublime skill right now with that two punch combo and now we got a fight he fires back a right hand of his own Once the inside fighter does get to the inside where he's comfortable, what can you do to stop him, to negate him? You need to take a little step back, create a little bit of a room. Move those feet a little bit. Step back, be able to get him off you a little bit. Takes one, but gets one. Good work by Joe Frazier. Mike Tyson digs deep with a big uppercut. Joe Frazier's putting his punches together now. That's a nice combination. Accuracy an issue there. Didn't land that straight right hand. Good flush shot by Joe Frazier. Frazier's combination punching is working well here. Inside, inside! Misses his opponent's headshot. How about a return to sender with the left hand? They're not exactly getting to know each other. They're just beating the hell out of each other early on here. Yeah, Joel, this keeps up. They're both going to have headaches, and we're going to have one of the great fights to talk about. Threw the straight right hand, but didn't score with it. Frazier's got to deal with a cut on his cheek right now. The good news is it's below the eye, but still, it could get nasty as the fight progresses. Teddy, he did a smart thing right there. Just created enough space and then landed the counterpunch. Looked like the will of the wisp, the old great Willie Peck. Made him miss, made him pay. And the bell rings, signifying the end of the round. Now that he's back in the corner, we get a close-up look. Joe Frazier's cut even looks worse. And it's up to the fighter now, Joe, for his attitude not to change. You know, we can look at it, and we can say, wow, that cut looks worse. The fans can look at it and say that. But the fighter must be steady, the same attitude, as though he doesn't have a cut. Otherwise, he has no chance of winning this fight. got a chance to do something very special here. He really puts forth some serious damage to his opponent in the last round. Now, possibly a stoppage, Teddy. Yeah, if he doesn't get over anxious, you know, if he doesn't rush in there and smother himself, he's gonna get the knockout. Nice block. Hit the nice work, Tyson with the hook. Oh, what a shot upstairs. He's gonna have to grab on. Tyson's doing well here with that two-punch combination. 
Oh, he just misses with that headshot. Locks it away. Frazier's left now getting into the mix. And he returns on that exchange. Halfway through round number two. Keeping his hands up, getting way of his opponent's effort. Good doubling up of the jab by Joe Frazier. Covers up nicely, gets rid of his opponent's body shot. right there he was just tagged by a big uppercut right hand downstairs look at the accuracy with that hook upstairs not hitting his mark there going upstairs a striking combination by Mike Tyson good block by Joe Frazier Pulls the trigger right away with the left hand after getting tagged himself. And that's the end of round two. Well, can the big, bad bully deal with blood? He's been cut. And he's cut many people before where he said, oh, when I cut guys, I saw that they started becoming less of a man right in front of me. I saw them start disappearing as men. Right now, we're going to find out how he behaves. I wonder if those words are echoing back in his ears. I need you to relax. I need, you, I need you to relax. Just believe in your skills. You got this, right? I need you to be patient and relax. Get in on and round number three is underway. Gets rid of that effort. Good looking right hand after he got hit. Frazier's the kind of boxer that wants to do just that. Find the target, get the combination working, land both punches. Little head knocking with that right hand. Tyson's combination punching, working out well there. He landed three solid shots. Oh, and the right hand comes into play by Mike Tyson. And you see what he can do when he sends that right to the head. Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. Well placed, well timed combo up top. He took a shot, but he gives one of his own. A left hand scores. Coming to the halfway point of this third round. Solid straight right hand. Right to the body. Targeting each other, the exchange was something special. Tyson's put forth a little boom, 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 a three-punch combination score. Mike Tyson with a big right hand. A headshot blocked. Double jab right to the face. Able to land the hook to the head. Tyson's right hand working well that time. He scored well. You're losing this fight. So take some chances now. You have to take a chance with this guy, right? Beautiful. Nice movement there. Keep that up. Keep moving. Well, he's up three rounds to zip on Teddy's scorecard here as we start round number four. He's a volume puncher, and that's exactly what he's doing to bank away these.